inhabitants of the World Wide Web, how is life? Welcome to the Date Almost Anything Simulator. I was browsing around on Itch.io, which seems to be my main source of game finding. Um, I was you know, browsing around on there, and I found this. I thought, what's missing from my life? A significant other. What do I want to do? Cry, mostly. But also, I found this. Maybe I won't feel so lonely. That is probably the saddest thing I have ever said. Okay, so we're just going to get into it. I have no idea what's gonna happen. I hate quotations. Tell me what you know. Okay. Woof! I barely made it in time for my first day of work. Now, where is my name tag? My name is... We'll go with my normal name. We'll go with Mal. Aha! Gotcha! Starting from today, I'll be a barista at Starbucks Coffee. Good. Good. My at first actual proper job. <laughs> Grace, hey Mal, what's up? Ready to make some coffee? Sure. Grace and I have been best friends since grade school. Apparently, though I've never met this Grace before in my life, apparently we've been best friends since grade school. Thanks to her support and encouragement, I was able to get this job. Still nervous? Relax, you'll do great. When a customer orders a drink, all you have to do is follow the recipe. Nice. Here, let's practice. Do we have to? Make me a tall hot chocolate. Oh, okay. Chocolate steamed milk. Oh God. What was it? What was it? Was it a tall? It's a tall chocolate. Steam milk. Steam milk. Sweet. Let's see how you did. Oh God. I'm not gonna lie, but this isn't what I, what a tall hot chocolate should be. Oh, thanks. I think you must have done something wrong when you put in the ingredients. Well, why don't you bloody make it next time then, you cow? <coughs> Who's that? But she was already in the back. Hi, welcome to Stirbox. What can I get for you? I would like a regular black coffee. No sugar or cream or anything. Certainly. What size would you like? Tall, grande, or venti? Oh, why is this so complicated? What is this stupid cup of coffee? I, I don't, I don't, what? What? It's, it's like small, medium, large. It's really stressful. I shouldn't make coffee at home. Yeah, uh, I would like vol or venti, please. Will that be all? Yeah. 365 for a coffee 365 for a all right leaving the head i think that every single day honey don't worry about it it's sheldon oh god no <laughs> no <laughs> okay mal go for it one venti black coffee oh my god okay venti Dark roast, none, none. Sheldon, your drink is ready. Oh my gosh, I don't. This is this is where I like get. I got everything wrong. Just a basic recipe. I got everything wrong. Hmm, not bad. Thanks. You're welcome. At least you're more grateful than Grace. Well, now, great work. Thanks. On to the next customer. When do I actually start dating people, though? I don't want to make coffee, I want to start dating people. I've been making coffee my entire life. Give me the goods. Give me the good people. Oh, hello, who are you? Good morning, miss. Lovely day, isn't it? Yeah. Brilliant, brilliant day. This, fantastic. He wants a grande cappuccino. I don't care, I, marry me. <laughs> grande cappuccino. 4.45. Oh, that is so expensive! Wow! Oh, okay. Oh. Oh. This guy. What's your name? Zane. It's your time to shine. One grande cappuccino. Okay. Espresso, steam milk, foam milk. Oh, I've forgotten what it was. Was it grande? I think it was grande. Cappuccino. Oh, crap! 
Steam milk, foam milk. I think I've got this wrong. I've got it wrong. I've got it so wrong. Zane, don't leave me like you did one direction. <laughs> Grand, oh God, this isn't a cappuccino. Okay, well apparently it is. Please thank the other barista for me. You thank me yourself. He's got a Zane. That's where he's going. <laughs> he's going off to his solo career. Ugh, I don't care. I w just date me. <laughs> I'm lonely. Aww. Oh, little cutie. Little cutie pops with his little pink hair. No, no, So cute. I don't even know where to start. OTL. Oh god, don't tell me he's one of those. Please don't be one of those who use internet speak in real life. Although, to be honest, I do it, so, uh, lol. <laughs> A tall latte. <clears throat> wow, there's cakes and pastries too. Hmm. Too bad I don't have the money for it. Nope. That's it for me. OTL. What does OTL even mean anyway? I'm not even, I don't even internet. I don't even know what this means. 395, may I have your name? I just go by Sammy. Like he's eating something sour. Thank you, Sammy. We'll call you when your order is ready. When, when am I going to get dating? That's what I want to know. Both IRL and in this game. When am I going to get dating? One tall latte. Espresso, chocolate, steamed milk. Espresso, chocolate, steamed milk. I think I'm actually getting young of this now. Starbucks, hit me up with a job. Here you go, one tall latte. All right, just take it, take it, go, go. Yes, stop. I'm, I'm grateful for the showering of confidence and compliments, but... The morning rush was over. Grace thanked me for my help. She said it was nice knowing that I've got her back. She advised me to take a break and look around the place. Where should I go? Go outside. I need to get a bit of vitamin D, cause you know, pale as- Since I was in such a hurry to get to work, I didn't get a good look outside the cafe. The cool wind and fresh air feel great after spending hours inside the small stuffy shop. The streets are peaceful with an occasional pedestrian milling about the storefronts. I don't know, look around some more? Sure. I wonder what's on the other side of the corner. Oh, hello. Hi, shot. Whoa. Oh. Oh, okay, so we're doing the romantic BS, you know, the kind of the, the, the knight in shining armor. Oh. He catches my arm and lowers me into a graceful dip. Yeah, he does. Yeah, he does. Zane. Oh, I'm so sorry, ma'am. Are you okay? Yeah. Sorry, I should have watched where I was going. If that ain't me, though. If that ain't me. How embarrassing of me. I must have startled you. So, like, is he just going to pretend he didn't dip me in front of these people? Does he do this on a regular basis? Probably. He looks like a regular dipper. Say, you look rather familiar. It's because I just served you your coffee. Yes, that is me. Hi. A destined reunion. Don't wink at me. You look so creepy, man. Don't wink at me. That's weird. My memory fails me. What's your name? <sighs> How do you not know who I am? <laughs> nice to meet you. Do you believe in fate? No, I don't. No. Absolutely not. I'm more of a choose your own path sort of gal. Mm-hmm kind of physics, you know? An object won't move itself. Yes, I am familiar with physics. <laughs> I think I just offended Zane. <laughs> Why, well, if you want to move in life, you have to take the initiative and force it to move. Pro tip. It'll take energy. It'll take time. And it's not always possible. But if you wait for it to move itself, you are guaranteed to get nowhere. She and I have talking a lot. She and I have talking a lot. I see. Thank you. You are a wise woman. You are a wise woman. Once I was a promiscuous fool. I slept with many people. Because <laughs> that's something you say to someone you just met. Hi. I was a bit of a wo I was a bit of a womanizer. Me. How's it going? And I got bored and moved on. Then I met him. 
He was unbound by the laws of physics. He was destiny. It's your destiny, destiny. <laughs> we were happy together. I was going to marry him. Is this Jesus? Are you talking about Jesus? But he betrayed me. I found him in bed with another person. Okay, well, not Jesus. He's also part of the LGBT community. Who would have thunk it? Um, yeah, I've never moved on either. Permanently trapped in the twilight. The poetic bastard. I, oh dear, I'm going off on a tangent again, aren't I? Yes, you are. Calm down, Zane. Apologies, your words ring truth. They are keys that open locked doors. Thank you for your time. I hope you have a wonderful day. And you, Zane. Nice to meet you, but please don't talk about your sex life again. That's really weird. <laughs> Well, that, that was interesting. The guy seriously just told me his life story. I know a few people like that. I'm gonna be honest with you there. I guess I should get back inside. Get in. My break ends and I continue working behind the counter. Before I know it, the sun is setting, signaling, signaling the end of my shift. Days turn to weeks, weeks turn to months. Same place, same time, same motions. Everything is the same, yet ever changing. I don't want this deep crap, okay? I, I don't want it. I, I, why am I getting messages? I, I'm getting messages from people. I am no longer lonely. It's, who am I kidding? It's my Twitter notifications telling me that someone's just woken up. <sighs> Forever alone. The world does not sit still for a nameless girl. Now she thinks she's... Bloody I I Stark! You have a name! Your name is Mel! We're the same person! Uh. Uh. The voices mingle like milk and sugar. The features melt together like coffee and cream. Good use of uh, similes there. Well, she met one, you've met them all. Bit of a generalization though, I mean, everyone is unique. Except one constant. Zane. Oh! Oh, I predicted that! Good afternoon, darling. Zane became a regular at customer at the coffee shop. So I'm being forced into a relationship with Zane. I hope Gigi knows. I hope Gigi knows. Gigi? Gigi! He usually comes here every Saturday during my break and we hang out and chat. However, lately he hasn't been coming in. This is the first time I've seen him in three weeks. Shocker. Hey, long time no see. I apologize for my absence. I feel like he should have a French accent. I'm not gonna do one because I'm gonna offend the entirety of France, but I feel like he should have a French accent. Do you know what I mean? Like, he looks like he should have a French accent. Yes. Uh, he's, yeah, he, uh, did you miss me? Not, not particularly. Uh, and, uh, apparently I did. Uh, apparently I did. I was bu busy publishing my second book, the one on commodification and ide idealization of love in mainstream media that I mentioned a while back. Oh, look at me, I'm publishing a book. I'm greater than that because I'm actually working in that and you're stuck in a coffee shop. And I really hope we don't end up dating Zane. I don't like Zane. Ugh, Zane. I'm a bit of a Finally finished it. I'll be sure to pick up a copy. I won't be. I won't be. Thank you. It will be available both online and in stores, even though people rarely go to bookstores anymore. Buy my book. I'm every YouTuber ever. Buy my book. Buy my book. I admit I'm awful with deadlines though and had to stay up through the night to finish in time. Oh well, like the saying goes, nothing a strong cup of coffee can't fix. Ha ha ha, the tenacity of the human spirit never ceases to amaze me. So Mal, how has life been treating you? Anything on your mind lately? What are you, Facebook? Shut up. Um, Zane, there's something I want to ask you. Please, ask away. No guarantee I will be able to answer it, though. Ha ha ha. I like you. A lot. Thank you, dear. Same to you. Will you be my... Oh, do you know what? Don't ask, don't get. Let's just go for boyfriend. Oh, my. It's 
straightforward, isn't it? This confession. It's a little exhilarating when you put it so plainly. I kind of wished it was another one. Like, I kind of wished it was Sheldon a little bit, not gonna lie. Mal, I... Wait, what? Hold it, hold it right there. You can't ask him out! You barely even know him! This isn't supposed to be a re realistic game or anything, but like... Come on! It makes no sense! I thought I was gonna be dating a coffee cup, not an actual person! <laughs> That's because you made him coffee and talked to him, like, once. He's obligated to date you? Nah, buddy! You gotta earn it! How did you get to this part of the game? You took initiative! You had options to run, to go in circles, to be a bad person, but you didn't. You persevered. <laughs> Am I getting told off by the creators here? Stop yelling at me! <laughs> you could do the right thing with a click of a button. Minimal effort. Easy peasy. Don't even have to think about it. A shame real life doesn't work like that. Or else I'd probably be rich and famous and not on my ass coding a dating simulator. I'm getting told off by the creators. Sorry. <laughs> I didn't even put this too soon there with your mouth open. Hey! Hey! I'm not sitting here with my mouth open. Not technically. Alright, shut up. You're wasting your time on a game called Date Almost Anything Simulator for Christ's sake, which is almost as pathetic as the dumbass who decided to make it. Oi! I don't need a lecture from you! What is it with this guy? Don't you have something better to do? I, I do, but I'd rather not do it. Thanks. Do you work? Finish your chores? Clean your room? I don't have a room to clean, okay? I It's being renovated. Shut up. Carpe diem? Oh! Bollocks to your carpe diem. Better yet, when was the last time you started a conversation with a stranger? Made someone coffee? Took take a nip in your own life, not just a video game. Okay, last time I spoke to a stranger was last time I was at a store. Don't remember when that was. I think it was up Thursday? Might have been Thursday. I think it was Thursday, because I bought something. And I told him to have a nice day. Made my mum a coffee this morning. So stick that up your pipe and smoke it. Shut up. Eat some food. I, I can't. I've eaten far too much today. I'm too full. Drink some water. Take a walk. In this neighbourhood? Are you serious? Buy the next person in line a coffee. I think I will do that actually next time. Hell, if you're really lazy, tell me about your day here. One click away I am, am I right? If you downloaded this game thinking it was going to be funny, here's a real funny joke for you. Oh god. I've been stitched up. <laughs> What's the funny joke then? I've been- I have been stitched up! Oh my god. The cheek. What does that do? That's saving. Oh my god. You feel that? That panic you felt when you thought the game was broken? I wasn't panicked, I was just curious as to what was going on. You would have done all that work to get to the end and not even see the ending. What a waste of time. This lecture is a waste of time, man. I'm getting bored. Which is exactly what I'm going to do right now. So yeah, I'm just going to end the game here. One big bullet to goddamn nothing. I'm going to leave you hanging. Let that sink in. <laughs> I'm not disappointed, actually. We're coming up to the 20 minute marker, so you'll be doing, you'll be doing me a favour. Betrayed? No, nope, not betrayed. Still hopeful, because you keep clicking that love mouse button. No, I want to see if you're going to actually round off this lecture. Go on. Complain. Get mad. Rage quit. Don't play this game again. Close this window. I wasn't... Delete the file. Turn off your computer and finish whatever you were doing before. You'll probably never want to come back after what I just pulled. I mean, to be honest, people have pulled worse, so I, I'd play it again, if, if it was... I, I, would I? Probably not, it's a dating simulator. But before you go, one last thing. Zane loves you. Well, I'm glad someone does. These are his words. My words. Whatever you decide to do after finishing this game will be the end. Will be there for you. In spirit, I mean. I get it, doing things is hard. Living is hard. Too many distractions, too many pitfalls, too many things to do or be. 
because Zayn and I are so proud of you for making it this far in life. Just like we are proud of you for making it this far in the game. Oh, it turned out it started off as a lecture and now he's telling me that he's glad that I'm alive. He's gonna have a go at me again in a minute, in a minute, isn't he? This is our breakup letter to time wasters. Instant gratification and procrastination. This is our love letter to you. Now go out there and change the world, love. Zane, end. Storyline. Coding. Yep. Yep. Well, that was interesting. I played to take the mick, and I end up getting the mick taken out of me. I don't know how to feel. <laughs> okay, well, I hope, I, was there other endings? Probably not, but um, that was good. That was good, it was a bit boring, a bit slow to start, but uh, the, the, the lecture at the end was really funny. I did really enjoy that. Um, so anyway, that's all for me for now. Thanks for your time. Have a great day wherever you are, and I'll see you real soon. Bye!